folks. Here's where we are this week. Progress on the cabin. I did just end up buying, even though it's expensive, I found some cheap exterior paneling. Uh, it's like 11.30 seconds. It was like 26 bucks a sheet, which is still ridiculously high, but I have, uh, I'm kind of at the point where I need to get this in the dry quickly. And I just took on two large remodels um, that are going to eat up all my time. So I opted instead of doing the chainsaw mill and doing the wood um, milling logs here on the property, to put this panel on just to try to get it done. Uh, like I said, I need to get it in the dry. I may end up cutting over the top of it. Doesn't look half bad, but it's not exactly the look I was going for. Got the rafters done except for this out here. Uh, built my headers, put my post in. <laughs> Panel on the side, I've only cut out the one up front. Um, this is kind of a when I have spare time project and uh, I'm not gonna be back out here till next Sunday. So Still gotta put cap rafter on this side. Then I still gotta put my uh, cross braces in for my eave, which will come out here about another foot overhang. Um, built the deck today set the rafters yesterday and then I put my loft in um, it's about how far the loft's gonna come got that part done still need to cut these windows out like I said it's gonna rain this week so I'm gonna keep those panels in to try to prevent this from getting wet Sturdied it up a lot by putting the panels on the side. Um, have you ever done any framing that once you start putting the boards around the side, it strengthens it up significantly. So earlier this was rocking, it's not really moving at all now. This still is a little, but that's going to happen. It's just boards right now. <clears throat> So I'm done for the day. I'm going to wait until I have fresh legs underneath me to put these on. Um, so I've got this huge step ladder that's going to have to be out here. And uh, on top of that step ladder, nailing these rafters in, it's going to be that point right there to the ground. It's probably 25 feet or better. On a, have uh, it's not something you want to do towards the end of a long day. You want to kind of do that early where you're not tired, get tired to make mistakes. You don't want to make a mistake 25 feet in the air. So loft's going to work out pretty good. Um, it's going to be plenty big enough. Like I said. I can, I'm just under six foot and I can stand in here. This isn't going to be a room. It's a place to lay down and sleep. So that's exactly what I wanted. Um, just going to put my cap rafters in over here. These outside rafters. And then I'll knock these braces off. And I've got one more window, two more windows. I've got to cut one in down there. And there's going to be one here looking out that way. I may end up buying another one for over here, but I'm definitely going to cut one that direction. So it'll be kind of nice. This will kind of be the view when it's the trees are all grown in. You can't tell. There's a highway probably about a mile that way is a highway or a, it's a road. Um, it's not like a interstate or anything like that so you can hear vehicles going by but 
it's pretty secluded. My house is on the other side of the ridge about you can go up the hill another 150 yards and then down the back down the hill probably 200 yards and my house is over there so it's a nice little secluded area. I said nobody on that's out here has built anything so this is like being in the middle of nowhere. Kind of nice. So that's it for today. See the deck work. Another thing I'm going to do, um, probably, i to kind of figure this out and see how much room I'll have out there. But I am thinking about, since this is one solid door that's going to be here, that's a solid glass door. Um, it's got about a probably four to six inch runner all the way around. I'm thinking about rigging, it's already got hinges on it, but making it to where it'll fold down and become a table, kind of like a bar. Um, the only thing is, is this is only 48 inches wide, so I don't know that I'll end up doing that because uh, you would almost be on the edge. It will take up most of this area. So I may not end up doing that, but it's a possibility. So that's where we're at for now. Probably gonna stretch this plastic over this flooring. Just to keep it from getting soaking wet. Headed back to the house. <coughs>